What up, y'all? So we finally broke the news to my oldest daughter, Nessa, that we're having a new addition to the family. Please, 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 please stop by Thurs Lynch Family on YouTube. Check out the new video. It's out right now. The link is in the description. All right, y'all. So we know that with everything that's been happening in D.C., all the crazy stuff that's been happening at the Capitol, right? The military is probably going to have to send, they probably sent some freaking soldiers, Marines, military personnel over to the areas to keep things orderly, disciplined, and safe over there, right? So, the crazy thing that happens is sometimes you get some components of military organizations, right? And maybe their appearance is not looking too good, man. I don't know, right? Only reason why I know about this is because I checked out the thumbnail to this video and I saw that soldier was, was looking pretty hefty. I, I look... I didn't like get a good, good look at it and look very into it. I looked real quick and I was just like, I saw more weight than I probably should have seen. All right. So I got to give a big, big shout out. Texas Will 254, Fast Donnie 316, and the YSL Vince for putting the hashtag SFAM React and the links to this video in the comment section. We got it once again, man. Angry Cops is getting ready to go in on these troops, on these soldiers, right? On these troops that are activated in DC. I don't know if they're technically becoming memes, but from seeing the appearance of some of them, I can see why they would probably be becoming memes, right? Memes, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and get into it. It's not a very lengthy video. I'm gonna. That's why we have to keep that professional look, man. We have to be slim, military slim. I don't know, man. Being big and having your uniform looking all crazy, this is what happens, bro. You don't look like you should freaking be a leader. You don't look like it. And then you're going to probably want your soldiers under you to look professional, and then you don't even look freaking professional. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into it. S-Fam stand up. Salute, say folks, motivated. Get motivated up in this ain't one time. Let's go. Let's cut to the chase. Over 25,000 troops have been activated and sent to D.C., in order to prevent any sort of craziness from happening I during doubt it. the inauguration of Joe Biden. I wouldn't doubt now, it. Now, when you get tens of thousands of troops in one area, there's bound to be one idiot or incident that makes us all look stupid, and this is no exception. Now, before I get to this, look at him. Look how big his gut is hanging out, bro. This is crazy, man. How does this, how does that slide, bruh? How does that slide in the army? Whether reserves, National Guard, I don't get it, man. Because how is he gonna be able to freaking run and get away from the enemy? Then again, you, I mean, you can't always judge. The army judges books by the covers. They, they really do. Even when it comes, now we're getting lucky because of COVID, we don't take our DA photos anymore. So for E6s to get promoted to E7 and on up up the chain, up up the line, they don't look at pictures anymore. But this is crazy, bruh. I want to know what rank, what rank he is. His gut is literally hanging out of his shirt. So imagine coming to formation like that. Imagine Sergeant Major holding a formation and you walk up and that's how it is, bruh. And maybe he would fix himself or something, but jeez, man. The thing, the, this is the thing about it, man. And y'all might think that I'm crazy for talking this crazy stuff about soldiers. Y'all might think AC is crazy for talking stuff about soldiers. But when we're in it, we can freaking talk about them, man. Just like the infantry. The infantry talk, I've dealt, I've worked with infantry drill sergeants. And they will tell you, they will talk crazy stuff about each other. But that's how they are. Even to each other in their own ranks. They talk crazy like that to each other. This is ridiculous, man. Let's go. Son of a bitch. We're gonna go over this photo. Notice anything wrong here? Let me see. Let me look what I can see, bro. Look at this. Her freaking close combat optics is on the bottom of the weapon. Even if she turned the weapon upside down, 
The magazine would be in the way. She wouldn't be able to see through it, bro. How? What the? Oh, like the optic is underneath the weapon, like some sort of mini fucking grenade launcher. Why? Who? What second lieutenant decided to put the optic underneath the weapon? You know what? I'm going to take charge and I'm going to make all the Joes put their optics underneath the weapon because that way they ship easier and they won't get knocked around. Well, that's a brilliant idea, sir, except for when they had to remove it from down there and replace it up top, their zero's gone. So now you have to shoot the weapon to make sure that the optic is accurate. If something pops off... I think he's getting ready to say if something pops off and they're in like the middle of a firefight in combat, they're gonna have to take that freaking close combat optic, put it back on top of the weapon. Then, just like he said, it's not gonna be zero. They're not gonna have their proper alignment. How are they gonna be able to use it to actually aim at any freaking enemy? I'm almost speechless. Let's go, man. You're gonna be having people aim down the street and shooting street posts 30 fucking yards over that way. Running around the street listening to it wang jangle on the top of their weapon, knowing that they gotta hit this. This is embarrassing, bro. I hope those backup iron sights on that weapon are good. And what is. Her leadership failed the hell out of her. No, but all the freaking. This female soldier have. OCP pattern body armor on right now, huh? This is why people can't take us seriously when we go out and do shit. The two years we've had OCPs and we've been prepping for them for longer than that. And I will say though, all right, depending on the situation here, battle with the AC, they got the the digital ACU pattern and not the OCP pattern. For her IBA, it looks like an IBA anyway from here. It doesn't look like it's an IOTV. But, like, I don't think I can just go to CIF and swap out just for a different pattern. I'm not, I don't think I can. I don't know, you know what I'm saying? Me being on the trail, and you're probably going to have some freaking words for me on this one. But my flick is still in the digital green and not the OCP. Now, I could easily just go and buy one. I could, and I just don't know why I have it, but I just have it. That's, that's on me. Let's go. We can't even get our body armor to match now. We're all mismatched like 2006 in Iraq. See, I, I, I had I, I know. three I different types it, of camo on it. I had desert, I had BDU, I had ACU pattern on my body armor and my uniform when I was overseas in Iraq. I look like a ragdoll soldier. Take pride in your uniform. How are you supposed to take pride in a uniform where you won't give me the right one? My stuff was look fresh though. She's looking at I have pride, my stuff was fuck? fresh. Pick all my straps, all my straps were all strapped up and everything. Everything looked good. Everything looked tight. You know what I'm saying? If it wasn't all, you and you know, you know how how trainees are with the straps hanging down. If you even tell them, tape up the straps that are hanging. Hey, get the little dangles and just let them go, bro. Let's go. The bottom. Oh, and speaking of making us look stupid, this. A celebrity in uniform. Look, everyone. Humpty Dumpty enlisted into the army. Holy shit, you took that no PT test until 2022. Fucking seriously there, didn't you, bud? Not as seriously as you take dessert. Not as seriously as your belt trying to hold itself together. Belt as is your down below the falls stomach, over bro. it. Aw, oh, Drew, be nice to the guy. Your body... No, we have a standard, standard. for yes. a reason. Yes. And this guy and his leadership failed him. Whoever is, oh my God. Oh. That's what I'm saying, bro. Thing I've ever seen in my life. Your mask isn't even over your face right now. Just like how your blouse isn't over your gut. I can see the bottom of your stomach <laughs> over your fucking pants. How do they find a vest big enough for this guy? He's got to have like four it's points only up stacked here. up it's like, like a checkerboard in order to block all that shit. Looking like an amoeba that just absorbed another soldier. The walking blob of the army. The only DC this guy's protecting is the Denny's Corporation. Wow. Oh, well, you keep that look going, by the way. You're holding your fucking helmet there, guy, like an Easter basket. Like a five-year-old going through the grocery store like his mom. How do you even pass? Now, holding the, holding the ACH like that, that's one thing I know that I've never really told anyone. Stop holding your ACH like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. The last time I could even think that somebody would hold it like that, like, in a, I don't know, man. Like, if we were deployed or something, and we were just getting off a mission, maybe we're walking like that with our, with our, I don't know. 
I would never hold it like that because then if the straps start to loosen up and stuff like that, it's always you got to readjust and tighten them up. So, but yeah, that's, I see why my battle buddies get so upset with this, man. Definitely. The standard is gone. The standard is just gone. And my main thing is, how are you going to look like this? If you look like this, how are your soldiers going to look? What can you tell them? You can't tell them, though, you got to go lose some weight. You can't tell them that because look at you. You see what I'm saying? It's a urine test, dude. You gotta lift up your gunt just to grab your dangle so then the guy can actually view the piss coming out of it into the cup. I can only imagine the smell. The only use that knife gets out of that pocket right there is for portioning up cake. How can you even, you, I know you've never passed a PT test because you couldn't Can't. get your arms out past your gut. Either lose the weight or get out. You are a liability. Nobody is dragging your ass in the middle of a fire. That's fight. another thing. You up to a Humphrey. That's I another thing. Having the highest score in PT does not make you a super soldier, but this is unacceptable. I bet you the straw in his gas mask doesn't just fit in a canteen. No, 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 no. I bet you got that straw enlarged so you can put it in the top of a McDonald's milkshake. I'm not, I'm, it's crazy, it's embarrassing, bro, it really is, man. Anyway, y'all, gotta thank y'all so, so much for checking me out in this video. I don't know what the heck that big dude thought he was, I, and that close, uh, that close combat optic on the bottom of that freaking weapon is freaking ridiculous, man, it really is. I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna talk about it. I'm gonna go ahead and end this one here. Thank y'all so much for rocking with your boy. SFAM stand up, salute, say folks, motivated, you motivated on this gent one time.